Are you starting? I don't know, but you right. showed me before. Is that how you do? Every evening, usually in a, a fall and winter, a lot of my grandmother um, friends would come over and they would just knit or crochet or saw and they would just get around and talk and me as a little child I like to sneak somewhere in there and just listen to the stories and they would just tell you know life stories or sometimes they would talk about ghosts and things like that. Victoria just came from school one day and she uh, brought paper home from the stitch house. Um, they offered a summer camp and she asked me if she could do it. First time we were making like a neck warmer. <laughs> so the first time I did it, it felt weird like in my hands. I got used to it. I get used to things fast. And they were just sitting there knitting, chit-chatting and drinking tea. And it was just, I thought it was just cold. She was amazed when I brought home some of the things I made. So she, start, she just wanted to know how to knit. And she showed me the neck warmer she was working on and I thought it was cool. And she wanted to know how she does it and she showed me and you know, the first time I picked up the needles, I liked it. We we just like sat, uh, sit down sometimes and she was like, teach me how to knit. I want to know, it looks cool. <laughs> she would usually teach me. It's mostly a relaxation thing. Yeah. Sit down and, you know, talk, ch chit chat with my daughter and, you know. Yeah. You're getting hang of it. Oops. I have a great teacher over there, so. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, we got this one so far. <laughs>